Okay, hi, this is uh, Steve Graves with the Geography Department at Cal State Northridge, and this is part one of a video tutorial uh, designed to help you learn to use ArcGIS. This very first uh, tutorial involves a projection, scale, and the latitude longitude grid system. So Hopefully you have logged on uh, to the VSL or to mycsunsoftware.edu and you see uh, the prompt here uh, for the various kinds of software. ArcGIS folder is the first uh, folder you will choose. You may double click on it and then double click on the Arc Map icon to launch the program. Click Allow. Down in the bottom, uh, do you, it, there's a prompt asking you, uh, do you want to open or save the launch.ICA? And click Open. Some of you may not see this prompt. Click Permit Use to allow your computer or your device to talk to the computers on campus at CSUN. You may click Cancel. Click Open on the file, um, the main toolbar. Click Computer. Find the network location called Geog Share. It may be drive H on your computer, but it may have a different drive letter. Select it. Click Open. Select the folder Geography 102 or Geog 102. Select Open. And select Introduction. Open. And Introduction. Open. The following pseudo projection of the Earth will open up. It appears to be a globe and it's still rendered in two dimensions but it looks like three dimensions. This area is called the map window. This area over here on the left is the table of contents. Notice that the layers in the map, um, these are the layers, are drawn or listed by drawing order. There are different ways of listing them, but this is the default format, and you should try to keep it on here. You may or may not see these other uh, toolbars, but this top one, which is the the uh, the main one, and then there, this one is called the Tools toolbar. And there's zoom in and zoom out, pan, zoom to full extent, a couple of other zoom in, zoom out. This is a selection tool. Uh, the pointer or select element and the identify button. In this lab you may also uh, try the measure tool and the go to uh, a point tool as well. Those are the tools that you are likely to use. On this um, toolbar, the main toolbar, there is this uh, map scale window and the map scale has some preset drop downs that you could investigate or you can um, enter 
new map scales if you would like. Note that we are starting at a scale of 1 to 64 million um, and you will be asked to understand what that means later but for now um, it is okay just to notice that it's there anytime that you change an extent want to zoom in or zoom out if you've made a mistake and you would like to go back to the start you can always go back to the previous extent so I'm clicking there and you will notice that it will go back one step now two steps and a third step to return us to the view that we started with. The layers that are visible are uh, the continents layer and I can uncheck that and they will disappear from the map and uh, by rechecking it they will reappear I can uncheck the major world cities and make those reappear. I can turn on and off the geographic reference lines layer as well. And that's how that works. We can even turn on and off the ocean background. Later you will turn on uh, some layers in the map that involve uh, Northridge, California, but for now this is all we're going to do. There are instructions that you should read that will introduce you to the notion of projection and there are questions that you must answer regarding those. And the first step after you have, when you are ready to answer those questions, the first step you must go through is to change the projection from this pseudo uh, world from space projection to a standard projection. Click on the word view in the top uh, drop down menu ribbon. Click data frame properties once. this data frame properties option window will appear. The coordinate systems tab should be already activated. If it's not, and it looks something like that, just click on coordinate systems and scroll up slightly until you see the word Mercator. Select it by clicking on it and click OK. Now the world map is projected in Mercator projection. Um, at this scale it is difficult to see the entire world so click on the little globe icon that says full extent. Click once and it will zoom out to an entire extent and then you may want to click on zoom in and refocus, recenter the map at a more comfortable scale. Note the scale, 1 to 150 million. Answer a couple of questions and press pause.